Koei Tecmo have recently revealed some new details about Attack on Titan 2 on their Facebook page as well as new screenshots. These details are about town life and playable characters, so let's go through what was said. Up first is playable characters and the description says, Prepare for a larger roster of playable characters. While there were 10 playable characters in the previous release, players can choose from returning and many new playable characters. Over 30 playable characters are planned beginning with the reveal of new playable characters Mish, Nanaba and Gelgar. Look forward to future updates about which characters will join the roster. Click through for more details on each character. More will be revealed soon. Over 30 playable characters, fuck yes. That is so many, that is 20 plus more than the first game and the three confirmed playable characters so far are Mish, Nanaba and Gelgar. So as well as these three, it's safe to assume that we'll get to play as all 10 of the characters from the previous game, which would be 13 in total so far and there are a bunch more that are yet to be revealed and apparently they will be soon, which is great. Feel free to let me know what characters you want to play as in the comments below. And up next is Town Life and the description says, Town Life, this is where characters can enjoy the ordinary life in between the battles. It can be used to develop relationships or perhaps to train and prepare for the next expedition. Town life is a vital part of the game for the character development as it does not only include the progression of the main story but it is also the place to evolve relationships with your companions through conversations and common missions, explore side stories and build up your fighting strength. In the previous Attack on Titan game there were areas where you could buy items, do missions, interact with characters, get requests from them and this time around I think the town is possibly the same thing but with more to offer and apparently it is vital for character development. I think this will work similar to when you complete a request for characters in the previous game as a cutscene played usually in relation to the character who gave you the request. I'm really intrigued to see more of this Eternal Life and hopefully we will soon. So that is all the details that Koitecmo Games has given us for Attack on Titan 2 in their recent Facebook posts. Real interesting stuff and apparently we will be getting more soon which I can't wait for and of course when they do release new information I will be covering it. So stay tuned for more Attack on Titan content. And as always thanks for taking the time to watch this video it is much appreciated and I'll see you in the next one.